Nike is dropping 2% of its global workforce, which is more than 1,600 jobs. In an email to employees Thursday, Nike CEO John Donahoe said, We are not currently performing at our best, and I ultimately hold myself and the leadership accountable. This is a really painful reality and not one I take lightly. The sneaker and apparel brand experienced a significant slowdown in sales, leading them to come up with a plan to save $2 billion over the next three years. But what does this mean for the Pacific Northwest, with over 15,500 Nike employees in Portland and Southwest Washington? Because there's zero degrees of separation between Nike people um, and, the, and Portland, because not only do you have employees that work at Nike, you have family members and you have um, you know, extended family and friends that work at the brand or have an association with the brands. That's Jana Panafilio. She worked at Nike for over 29 years. After leaving, she created an alumni group for past Nike employees called 6453 Alumni. We'd like to say that we're here to support as a landing place for those people as they leave the brand to make their transition from Nike to Next. The first round of layoffs start Friday and go into next week. Jana says 6453 Alumni Group will help those laid off, connecting them with other Nike alumni in various fields. There's a disproportionate number of former Nike people start their own companies, so they're looking for talent and they're looking for clients and so so there's just depending on what it is that they're looking to do or want to do or what kind of um, help that they need we have the resources to help them now this isn't the end of nike's downsizing at the end of may they'll have another round of layoffs